Hey guys, welcome back. Today we are doing another ballet or dance inspired workout. Today we are focusing all on the thighs. We are focusing on toning those inner and outer thighs. You don't need any equipment for this workout besides yourself, a little bit of space and a soft surface like a yoga mat or exercise mat beneath you. We are going to be on the ground for the majority of this workout, so please make sure you have something soft underneath you so you don't injure your back. Other than that, I think that's it. Just make sure that you can see your screen so you can follow along with me as we're going to be doing a bunch of different exercises and you'll need to follow my cue. And without further ado, let's get to it. All right guys, we're first going to start off on our backs. We're gonna start off in a glute bridge position. You're going to go up on your tippy toes here. So place the balls of your feet on the floor. Bring them a little bit closer to your booty. We're gonna press up into a glute bridge, squeeze those glutes and squeeze those inner thighs together and slowly lower down. We're gonna stay here for 30 seconds. Pretend like you have something in between your legs and you're squeezing it together, engaging those inner thighs. Alright, we're going to stay in this position, stay on those tippy toes. We're going to hold at the top here, open and close. Open and close. Again, pretend like you have something in between your legs and you're squeezing it together, engaging what's in your thighs. The knees shouldn't touch as you come together. Alright, we're going to hold this position and we're going to pulse. So you're going to come halfway down and all the way up. And pulse. Pulse. So you're going to feel this in your glutes and you should also feel this a little bit in your inner thighs as well. Stay high on those tippy toes. Alright, we're gonna repeat all of that but once again. So we're gonna start off with regular foot bridges. Come down and just those feet if you have to. Press all the way up and all the way down. So this workout is all about slow and controlled movements. Focusing on the form mind-to-muscle connection. Alright, we're going to hold at the top. And we're going to open and close. Press those hips high to the sky. You're going to feel the burn here. All right, we're getting ready for 30 seconds with pulses, and then I'm gonna give you guys a break. So make sure you don't drop those booties halfway down, all the way up. Focus on keeping that core engaged. 
Pressing that lower back into the floor. All right, we're gonna hold here, knees open, flex those feet. You're going to extend and in. Extend, straighten those legs as hard as you can and bring them in. So squeeze those inner thighs together as you stretch those legs. All right, now we're gonna put both of those together. So you're gonna come in, open, extend, and in. Close, open, extend. Again, keep that core engaged. Control those legs. All right, we're gonna repeat that all again, starting from the beginning. So just open and close. Open and close. You're gonna feel this in your inner thighs. Don't forget to breathe. Open those knees as wide as you can. Keep those toes together. Don't stop. All right, we're gonna hold on our next open and we're going to extend. Flex those feet, stretch those legs, and bring it in. Stretch, and in.
All right, give that leg a little bit of a break. We're gonna repeat that once again on the same leg. Getting ready to go into those clamshells.
All right, getting ready, last 30 seconds of circles. Don't drop that leg. Nice big circles, really try to reach that back corner with that leg. Good, all right, taking a quick 15 second rest. We are standing up for the last minute here. We're going to do a squat in second position. So toes pointed outward, squat, and as you come across, you're going to bring one leg in front. So you're going to squeeze that inner thigh together. Cross and in front, squeeze. Cross, squeeze. Open, squeeze. Really try to stretch those legs as you come up on those toes. Keep the upper body strong and lifted. You can put your hands on your shoulders to help remind you to keep that body up. inspired thigh workout it's something a little bit different maybe something that you guys aren't used to doing but I love these workouts because it forces you to move your body in a different way engage muscles maybe that you aren't used to engaging and basic exercises like squats and things like that it's really great for toning and defining those muscles I hope you enjoyed this one if you did give it a thumbs up for me let me know how you enjoyed it how you did in the comments down below and if you're new here, hit that subscribe button, turn on your post notifications so you don't miss another workout from me, and I'll see you guys very soon. Bye.